Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to cook fiofio -fio without having to add potash water. Fiofio -fio is also known as pigeon peas in English language. It is also a very popular dish in Nigeria. So the first thing you need to do is to put a clean water in a pot and put it on the stove. Allow it to boil. Once the water starts boiling, you add two full spoons of salt to the boiling water. Then you add your fuel fuel to the boiling water and cover the pot. Allow it to cook for 15 minutes. Now it's time to sieve out the salt water. Sieve out the water from the fuel fuel. Rinse the fuel fuel with cold water. Now pour the fuel fuel back into the pot. Add cold water. Add enough water to allow the fuel fuel to cook for a while, for like one hour, depending on the pressure of your stove. While the fuel fuel is cooking, it's time to peel your yam. You also need to prep other ingredients which you are going to use to mix the fuel fuel when it's time. Ingredients like onions, if you are also going to use fresh pepper, now is a good time to prep the fresh pepper. Once the fear of is almost done, you know it's almost done when it starts getting soft. It's time to introduce the yam into the pot. Add the pot and allow the yam to cook. Once the yam is done, remove the yam from the pot and sieve out the remaining water from the fuel fuel.
Now place an empty pot or pan on low heat. Add your red oil to the pot or pan and allow the red oil to get hot. Once the oil is hot, it's time to introduce your onions into the oil. Allow the onions to cook for some seconds and then it's time to add your salt. Then your seasoning cubes. If you're also using fresh pepper, this is a good time to add the fresh pepper into the hot oil. Now turn off the heat and introduce the oil into the pure fuel. Mix everything together. At this point, I added my dried pepper because that's what I used for this recipe. Once you're done mixing everything together and adjusting the seasoning, it's time to introduce the yam into the fuel fuel. I like to cut my yam into tiny pieces before mixing it with the fuel fuel. So there you have it, the fio fio is ready to be served. There you have it, easy and delicious fio fio. You guys, this fio fio turned out so delicious. I hope you try out this recipe and let me know how it went. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up. If you have any questions, you can drop them in the comment section and I'll reply them. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!